Hey guys, we're back, and just please skip to where we find her. This this took me so long to figure out. Haha. And I'm trying my best. Push box. Liar. You're an unbelievable liar. How can you lie with such a straight face? You should just disappear. Anne! Ah, uh, she found out. Anne, are you okay? They didn't do anything weird to you? Sophie. Good, guess you're not hurt. Anne, let's get out of here now. I'm not sure what's going on. I just know it's weird. Get up, Anne. They might come back if we don't hurry. Yeah. Also, what did you lie about? I'm curious. Ah! What? Liar. What are they? No. No! Wait, Anne, don't go, it's dangerous. No, no more, I'm going home, let me go home. Anne! Let go! How? I'm sorry, Sophie. I was scared. Anne! God. Ah, after I found you, you just run away? My thoughts exactly. Oh, forget about Anne. Go cower all alone if you want. Like, seriously. I just found you. And it would give me a game over if I didn't find you. <sighs> now do I leave? Yay, I do. Thank you. Oh, so you solve it like that and got it? Oh, I see, that makes sense. You're really smart, Sophie. I can't even do my own homework. I'm envious. You're always so calm, mature, and smart. And you're really nice, too. And if it were me, Reagan was bullying, I don't think I'd be brave enough to come to school. I wish I could be more like you, Sophie. The teachers always say you try your best, Anne. And I have to agree. You're way better than me. Sorry, Sophie, for, for never saving you from Reagan and her bullies. I just want to help, but I'm just too scared, so I watch. I'm really sorry. Look, I don't mind at all. You shouldn't either, Anne. I'm just happy being together like this. Thanks. You're my best friend, Sophie. Okay. Sophie? Oh, David. Found anyone else awake? Nope, no good. I checked the hospital and hotel, not a single eye open. Hmm. What about your friend, Sophie? She ran home crying. <laughs> Didn't find her? No, well, I did, but she ran off. Ran? What do you mean, ran? <laughs> um, I'm having a feeling you're not going to believe me, David. <sighs> Strange red shadows. What could that have been? I haven't seen anything odd. D do you believe me? Well, it's not a lie, is it? I know you're not a lying type. Thanks, but I wonder what's up with these. No one's awake, and those weird shadows. Yeah, this isn't exactly normal, huh? But doesn't mean we can't necessarily do anything. I'm gonna have to keep looking for others. Maybe I'll find out some sort of resolution. Sophie, come with me this time. Like I said, it's too dangerous. But, I mean, it's not very effective to go door-to-door -to -door together in such a big town, is it? Don't you think splitting up would be faster? I swear I'll be fine by myself. I said no. I can't let you go alone. Who knows what could happen? Fine. I'm only troubling you, David. I'm going. I'd feel a lot safer having you with me than you getting into danger out of sight. Fine. But you can at least tell me where you'll search. I was thinking of checking the West End. It might be that the people still awake are gathered all together. So I'll check Bloomberg Mall. 
Ah, I gotcha. But try to stay out of danger, okay? Come back to this park as soon as you're done. Yeah, got it. It's not like you're my dad, God. Can I ride on that little pony? Hospital! Use the town map. Okay, Bloomberg Mall. Where am I right now? Mm, I don't know. Two hours later. There! God! Figures. I'd be a real thief breaking the door to a mall. How can I get in? Not sure, but I think I need a security card if I want to open the sock. Someone's sleeping inside. A worker for the security company? Hey, the door's open. I think I can go in. Well, duh. I mean, what else are we gonna do? Go on the other side. Why are you going in on this side? This guy's a safety guard, then maybe he has a card. He's a violent sleeper, isn't he? Yay, guys, I found it. It's not like I cried a little bit. Oh my god. E B A one four two. E one so twenty four nineteen seventeen? I don't know. I'm I'm making shit up. Twenty four nineteen seventeen? Yay, I'm not stupid. Ew, that's so creepy. Oh my god, that's so creepy. I'll be honest, that weird bear, chipmunk, raccoon-eyed bear thing. So creepy. I know there's someone on the staircase, but like, a doll, some kid must have forgotten it. Oh god. Oh. Ew. Ew, burn it with fire. Hmm. Well, this is kind of creepy. Kind of, just a little bit. Ow, that hurts my ears. What was that, a gunshot? Oh great, now I'm gonna get shot. There must be people awake here, just hope it's in a good way. Shutters are down, so you can't get in. Oh, duh, I'm going the wrong way. There we go. I hate horror movies. Even the commercials for this was scary. I, I wish they'd stop playing it at night. What are you talking about? Horror movies are fun. They're exhilarating. They make you a digital remastering of the immortal classic, Kenny Got His Gun. Hey, I've seen this. I think it's a war movie. Kind of scary, but it's cool to see it back in theaters. I want popcorn now. I know, I'm 
I can't make up my mind, you guys. You can't make this stuff up, guys. You can't make this stuff. Oh, now it has glasses. I hear voices. Someone's in there. Quick, go in there and investigate. Oh, look. It's actually just a bunch of random soldiers with helmets and guns. Hold on. They're on the stage? Oh, my God. Regan? Why is she there? Listen up, maggots. It's time to give this Missy her due. Sir, yes, sir! Oh, I like that. What's that, maggot? Say it again! Sir, yes, sir! Hey, what's going on here? Untie me this instant. Quiet, Missy. We've had enough of your squawking. Am I understood? This Missy must be punished as an example. Answer me, recruits. How do I we punish the gal? Firing squad! That's right. Looks like you do know a thing or two. The execution will be in 30 minutes. Nobody comes near her till then. And let no one into the building. Find one, you fill them up with more holes than a beehive. Sir, yes, sir. I don't know how to do- No! Someone help me, please! What are you standing around for? Get moving, maggots! Sir, yes, sir. Oh no. They're coming this way. I have to hide. Was that me controlling her running or not? Because either way, I did the same thing that... <laughs> Anyways, what was that? Those aren't real soldiers, are they? Soldiers wouldn't do that. Why did they capture Reagan and now they're trying to kill her? I don't get it at all. I have to help her. She might just get killed if I leave her be. Yeah, she might. I'm not saying that's a good thing, I'm just... <laughs> Reagan, Sophie, why are you here? Quiet, they'll notice us. I'll untie the ropes. Ah, they're way too tight. Hold on, I'll find some to cut it there. Everybody, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> uh, got cutter. Okay. I didn't know what to do for their whispering scene. <laughs> her face damn it what's with those guys up and saying they're gonna kill a girl what did i ever do huh and bullied reagan why are you here so late at night huh how should i know i was sleeping in my room then i woke up here they must have kidnapped me they, they came into mama's mall i'm i'll be have them sued I think that can wait for later, Reagan. Things are weird in town. Everyone's asleep and there are these shadows. At any rate, we should get out of here. There's a friend of mine outside. What? Escape? That's never going to happen. They're patrolling. They'll find us if we move. Well, then what, Reagan? They're going to notice you got away. If you sit still, they're gonna find you. Shut up! Don't order me around, Sophie. You try and escape if you wanna. I'll wait for Mama to help. Aren't you guys in, like, I don't know, college? Dorms? Reagan. Slap her. Why are you crying, Regan? Oh, this is childhood. Ma Papa and Mama are fighting again. And Papa was yelling and Mama was crying. I'm too scared to go back home. Slap. Hey, Regan, my Mama's dead, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Why'd she die? She was shot by Ban Cropper or something. I, so I don't have another. It's just... Me and Papa. 
But I don't cry. I have to keep on going. So you shouldn't cry, Reagan. If you cry, you're a crybaby. Do you want to be a crybaby, Reagan? Oh my god. No, I don't want to be a crybaby. Then play with me. Your mom and dad should get along soon. We can play until then. Okay. <laughs> you know what, Reagan? My mom's dead. At least you have a mom. Crybaby. <laughs> what? I said you're a crybaby. You act so high, mighty, bullying people, but you can't do a thing by yourself. Say that again. Why don't you? Crybaby. I'll say it again and again. You haven't changed once since kindergarten. You're useless without your mommy to help. Even your bullying, you just use me to take out your stress when things aren't going well at home. Shut up! You say that like I need you. First of all, you and me, completely different. You're just jealous. No mom and your dad abandons you. You're jealous because nobody will save you. That's not... My papa may be trash, but mama loves me. Right the second she's worried about me. I'm sure she'll come look for me soon. And nobody will come looking for you, so don't lump yourself with me. Bitch slapper. Uh, uh, please, please, please slap her. Slap her. I'm s So what? You're going to just sit here for your mom until those soldiers come kill you? Sorry, but that's not my idea of a plan. I'm going to stay out of their sight and run. What about you? Fine, I'll come with. But how do you th expect to escape? I don't know. It's dark. I'm sure there's a way to avoid being seen. We'll do something. Be like Snake and just hide in a cardboard box. Oh my god! We could use this. They are! Oh, that's cool. Wow. Hold sub key, so shift, no, when you squ to squat, when squatting, you'll be safe if you don't move. Okay, sub key, sub key, what is a sub key? Oh, now it is. <laughs> we got a box on our head, we're ready to go, guys. not gonna move oh my god <laughs> whoops a ton of soldiers. Let's plan now. It's now. We're not making it outside like this. Oh, be quiet. Maybe I can distract them somehow. I know. If I toss this doll, it'll distract them. <laughs> Quick, let's run for it. Run! Uh, we did it! We escaped! 
<laughs> oh god, that's a lot of people. They're watching us, Regan, run. We did it, Regan. I think we lost them. Regan? Regan, where'd you go? N now what? I have to find her, but David might be waiting. Okay, I'll have David help. I'm sure the two of us can find her. Stealth mission, yes. Not doing that again, you know why? Because I'm lazy. David, you have to help. What's the hurry? Reagan, an old friend of mine, she might be killed by soldiers. Please, help me look for Reagan. She might be killed if we don't find her. And, 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 too. What if... Sophie, calm down. What in the world happened? At the mall, there were these soldiers. I tried to help Reagan. We got away, but Reagan... Sophie, what's wrong? I think I gave him a lower voice. I don't know. I just feel tired all of a sudden. Sophie, take a break. You're pushing yourself too much. It's okay. I'll listen, but first you need to calm down. And then she passes out. Suspicious soldiers? What could that be about? Is the army getting involved in this? I don't think they're real soldiers. I mean, it's too weird. Why send a high school student... Oh, so they're in high school. Why send a high school girl to a firing squad? Yeah, I'm really at a loss here. But I'm sure your friend is fine. I haven't seen any shadows or soldiers like you saw. Uh, maybe they just can't go outside. You made it out with her, right? So she should be fine. Don't worry yourself sick. At any rate, take a break. You shouldn't push it. I know, that's what I always say. Sorry for always worrying you, David. Hey, don't bother me. I'm just, I'll be happy if you don't do anything rash. Hey, Sophie. I really am worried for you, you know. You always seemed pained ever since we met. Is this going to be a flashback? <laughs> Sophie, let's go have lunch. Yeah, give me a second, huh? What's wrong? I thought I had five bucks in my wallet. Did I drop it somewhere? Hey, look, girls, I just found a fiver. Oh, really? Talk about lucky, Reagan. Guess I am. I suppose some doofus dropped it today. I'm going to splurge on desserts today. <laughs> um, Sophie, I've got some allowance money. I can pay for lunch today. I don't want much. I just lost my appetite. That was me during lunch. Like, it's not like I lost my money. It's just more like I just lost my... I just didn't have an appetite. Man, I'm hungry. I knew I should have had Anne get me some lunch. Candy store. Maybe I have enough for ice cream? Mmm. This new ice cream is great. Maybe this was a stroke of luck after all. Ah! Whoa, sorry, I wasn't looking. Are, are you okay? Are you hurt? My ice cream! Oh, your ice cream. I'm sorry, I'll pay for it. Did I get it on your clothes? Are you okay? It's fine. It's just some ice cream. Sorry for bumping into you. But, um, do you mind me asking something? Are you, are things going okay for you? You look really pale. I'm just tired. I've always been pale. I'm fine, really. So please don't worry. You don't need to pay for the ice cream either. I'll just eat it off the ground. Well, look. And that's how we pick up girls after school. What kind of... Oh, I was gonna say, where are their chairs? But I guess these, um... <laughs> Looks like he shat his pants. Okay. The cake here is really good. I love sweet stuff myself. I come here all the time to unwind after work. I'm really sorry about earlier. I hope you can forgive me. Thank you very much. I am just a cute little schoolgirl. He's right, this cake is great. I feel like it's been so long since I had ate some good food with someone. Aww. Sophie, what's wrong? 
I have parent issues. Bullied? Well, I'd say that happened to me too, but flight school is different from girls' Catholic school. Bullies just can't face up to themselves, you know? Can't solve their own problems, so they attack others. Sucks having to be the victim, of course. Yeah, you might be right. Maybe the girl who's bullying me can't face up to herself. I knew her as a kid, and I know she, there's family trouble. But I remember how we used to play together, so I can't bring myself to tell her to stop. I feel like I should just put up with it. No, no need to torture yourself like that. Maybe you should just be honest about it. Oh, well, sorry. I know I'm a total stranger, so it's none of my business. Don't say that. I feel better just having someone listen. Thank you so much. Okay. More like, you're like my distant cousin. <laughs> the cake was delicious. I'm glad you listened to me, too. I don't have anyone else to talk to. Well, goodbye. Sophie. I, uh, live nearby, actually. If we see each other again, would you talk with me? At the very least, I can listen if you want me to. Is that okay? Yeah, of course. If you're troubled, come to this restaurant. And if we see each other, we'll talk. Thanks, distant cousin David. We've met up to talk things out many times, but you still seem so troubled, and all the more so lately. I just can't help but worry. It's not like anything really changed since we met. It's just one bad thing after another, and I'm as sleepless and irritated as ever. Enough of this, okay? Enough about me. I can put up with it. Lots of people have to suffer. I don't want to be one of those who whines and cries about it. I can forget about the bad things with time. And the situation is more important. We've barely seen any other person awake, and we have no clue what could be going on. Hey, Sophie, have you seen your father? Eh? Your father stays at work a lot, right? So I was wondering if you saw him, was he at home? No, he wasn't. He left a note saying he'd be at work, so I'm sure he'd be there. I'd say go f look for him. You're worried about him, right? I'm worried about Reagan and Annie, too. Well, I can look for those two. Your father works at J.P. Gordon and Chase, right? I'll head there, too, if I find them. And if you finish first, come to the fountain in the park, okay? Thanks, Cousin David. I'll do that. David! What? Is there anyone you want to look for, David? Anyone really important you want to see? Nope. <laughs> I'm just happy if you're safe. Because my girlfriend had dumped me. My friend uh, also... Was, was it, did his girlfriend dump him for his best friend or something? Or was it like, oh, my girlfriend dumped me. My friends were trying to make me feel better, but they ended up making me more paranoid. My mom also had a tumor in her brain, and that made her... I think she had a tumor. I don't know. A lot has happened to David that I'm just like, damn. Nope, I'm just happy if you're safe. Huh? Well, I'll see you later. Be careful. Okay, so it, he wasn't... She isn't the girl that he met back in The Crooked Man. Is this it? Yeah. Chuck Feeler. Weird glasses on this guy. Sorry, but good work doesn't excuse that degree of lameness. Oh, that's mean. Card reader. The store won't open without a pass, and I don't have one of those. Oh my god. Let's find someone who does. Actually, let's actually end the video. How about that? Uh, I have the other games for this, just not Crooked Man, because, you know, like I said, I saw someone play it. Uploads, I hope to possibly try and do once a week, maybe. Maybe do twice a week every once in a while.
but yeah. That guy looks like- That's the guy! I need his suit. H-N-S. But yeah, I think I'll end it there. Thank you guys for watching. Um, please be safe during this chaotic, hectic time. And please be kind to others. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. And goodbye.